Well, hello everybody. Hope you're doing well. Uh, today you're catching me on one of my walks because like many of us, we've gained weight and need to lose that weight before we see people again. So here's the deal. Uh, hasn't It hasn't been said very often, um, but it's something that I think needs to be said. Um, all throughout the Bible, you can read where um, people have said, you know, help me to not look to the right or to the left and help me stay on course. And I think that's something that needs to be said here and now in our world today. There are so many times where even on this walk, I have felt, you know, the grass come up and touch my leg or something. And it'll start me, you know, thinking of all the what ifs and that fear sets in. And there's times where I think I can multitask, I can listen to music, I can look around. And with that, I then start to, you know, veer off course a little bit. And that's not good. God didn't ask us to multitask. He asked us to look straight ahead and asked us to focus on him. And that can be really difficult for some of us, but that is why it's so encouraging to read scripture and to see that so many people have said the same thing. Help me stay on the path. Help me not look to the right or to the left. And it's so incredible to see that all throughout scripture. Because as we can see in 1 Peter, Satan is just lurking at the door for us. He's waiting to take any advantage to pounce on us. And one of those ways is just the debate with wearing a mask or in-person versus online services, all sorts of stuff. Whatever he can use, he's going to use to divide the church. So my encouragement to us today is to stay on the path, to stay the course and not look to the right or to the left, but use this time to focus on God. Because when we start to multitask, when we start to do things that are gonna veer us off course, that's when Satan's gonna step in. He's gonna use debates every single day that are gonna challenge us, that are gonna keep our focus off God, and they're gonna keep us from loving others as we should. So my encouragement to you today, stay the course. See you guys, bye.